And that's my um, first day back at work, over, over with. And I've just finished doing my path to part like it every day. And now I'm watching just Judy, as you could probably hear in the background. And I suppose I've got to start tidying the house up. So I'm not looking forward to it. That's my name badge for work. Obviously it's not called Kieran, but stuff I'd use it anyway. It's been for bed. Alright, this is another this is another daily occurrence for me. Where I go and check if we have any mail come to the front door. Except a pair of shoes that Harry left here at Halloween. Time is five past three. Let's go down a bit. That's a bit missing there from last night when I didn't. That's the view out of that kitchen. Oh, pretty much crappy really. Oh, there's my my glasses that me and Shireen got this morning from McDonald's. It's quite nice actually. It's quite nice going to McDonald's with Shireen. And I think that's about it. Okay, I've just had a shower and a shave. Ready for work tomorrow again. It's um, the afternoon, it's about quarter to five, so I'm just tidying the house because it's a bit of a mess, as you'll be able to see now. I'm scanning it pretty quickly because I don't want you to see how bad it is really, but obviously this kitchen from last night, all that needs cleaning up. So I'm just going to tie it up and I'll be back with you. And so the quick tour of my house continues. Excuse the detail on the banister. This would be my bathroom. Someone's on it. So, oh, it's good. Spare bedroom. It's a bit of a mess, really, to be honest. Not really anything you want to show off. But it's where Grace stayed when she stayed over. TV in there. Oh, blurry. Anyway, yeah, that's the spare room. Back out into the hallway. Lovely stand up lamp. The flowers that were here when I got here. And my bedroom. My favourite part of the house. Just waiting for Ian to turn up again now. It should be texting me in a minute. But while I'm waiting, I'm watching a bit of just you do. If you can see that or not, the beauty of it is just you. 
Well, so, um, it's pretty much my day. Pat Head has gone down to Wolver for the weekend. And I went to. Um, I went to Matthew D's again and got two more glasses. Um, I think that's pretty much it. Day two on the recording my week at home and finishing work or whatever. I'm just logging on to my computer now to pay my water bill. It was good and I'll be seeing Ian later so I'll speak to you in a bit. Ian's just texted me to say that he's just setting off to come around and see me and hopefully I'm going to be able to video him before he gets here, well, as he's getting here. Just sitting here watching Swept Away. I don't know if you can see that or not. It's all looking a bit weird. But, um, yeah. So hopefully I can video him when he gets here. Fingers crossed. <laughs> right, I've just got back from um, going out with Sharon and Shireen and Sharon's friend Cheryl and I've uh, bought some food from Asda and I'm just about to cook it up but while I'm cooking it up I'm going to tell you all about tonight because it's well done. So we met Sharon, me and Shireen met Sharon from work and uh, about 2 o'clock and then we got a lift into Wigan with Cheryl about the same time. We all had something to eat in Berkeley Square and had a good time. It was alright, it started out alright. And then obviously Shireen's boyfriend turned up because they've just split up with each other so um, it was really, really funny. Well, not funny because Sharon, Shireen was really upset. And um, so I'm just reading the instructions here. He came into the pub and he was arguing with Shireen. Really, really, really bad. So um, then we went. We were in Crampot at the time when he started arguing with him, and then we moved to a place called Harry's Bar, which is just down from there. So I've already never been in there before. It seems all right. It just feels like weirdos. So um, we went in there, and as luck would have it, we were, we sat right in front of a window. And he could see, he walked straight past and saw us again. So he was asking Shireen to go out, and she went out, and she didn't go out with him, which I thought was quite good of her. But then I thought I kind of said she should do what she wants to do, really. And then we had a couple more drinks, and then me and Shireen went home. Walked home, and it's about five past seven now. So. Um, we had quite a good night all in all. Obviously Sharon was chatting up some lads at the bar, which was a bit off-putting. We were just sat there laughing at it, to be honest. But we had a really good night and now I'm just making myself a, a meal from after, which is it's quite nice actually. Just a match. And then I'll probably watch a bit of TV and maybe get into bed for the rest of the night and watch a movie. So this is me going back upstairs after making coffee and um, going to have a shower and get ready for the rest of the day. Charlie next door is playing um, Ed Sheenan again. I get the finish must really love that bloke. It's getting a bit worrying. Just one of them do my hair. Yeah, thanks for that. This anyway, uh, do you want me to start again? No. No, we carry on. We're adding to the authenticity of Okay. Anyway. Me and Ariel are just ordering our meal for tonight. And what are you ordering today? We're ordering... 
Rice and chips. 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 Oh, as soon as possible. And just so that we don't see Aaron's car details, we shall now move to in front of him. So watch his concentration. Oh, I have to put that right. And here we can see the deep concentration of a man desperate to get his curry. When it says expiry year, do I have to put the whole thing in or just put... Just put... And so if you saw the car details then, please just ignore. Yeah, they were only see the special there are only dummy ones you didn't see the uh, CV3 number yeah uh, we can soon fix that <laughs> I bet we can and here you can see how Aaron and Ariel are this really drowned at the hip oh. hi. hi Ariel <laughs> have you had a good day today Ariel not really. Will Aaron get his curry? Oh, no. Will it be any good? Oh. Find out later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> so that'll be to connect it to the. Huh? So that'll be to connect it to the TV. That'll be to charge it. What else have we got in here? Ooh, the USB lead! <laughs> <laughs> have we finished yet? Hello, Aaron. Hi, Ian. What have you got today? Uh, a disc. Aren't you lucky? I got a camcorder! <laughs> lucky you. Say cheesy what's it? Ian's got cheesy what's it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Have you said it? Yeah. Hola! We've just got our takeaway from Sunny. We got two free fortune cookies. And I've got chicken curry with boiled rice and some of Aaron's chips. And I've got a chicken chow mein mm. with mm. the chips. Now we got some satay chicken in the other room. Should be in here. Anyway. Emma, what's you come down again? It's so good we can't stop eating. Oh, someone's got pasta pot. <laughs> the, yeah, it's gone off today. It goes off. Today. Till midnight. <laughs> Till midnight. <laughs> You sit at 11.59 and... Mm, mm, uh, it's gone off! <laughs> I don't want it now! Do you need a bag for them? No, I'll be okay. Are we recording? Um, yeah. Oh, yeah. Can't believe you're going there. <laughs> it's so shocking there. Yeah. Okay, well this is how I'm ending the DVD. So... I'm going to edit it now and put it all together and hopefully it should look okay. Well, I doubt it will, but fingers crossed. And um, I'll see you on the flip side.